All right, hello everybody. Today we are at Landmark. This is the Port Washington Children's Center, the Landmark building in Port Washington. And we are going to be exploring the Landmark building. So give me a second and we will we'll be taking off momentarily as soon as I check to make sure that it's safe. Looks good so far. And take off. Take off. It's a little bit windy today. The home point has been updated. Please check it on the map. So I'm going to hope that this works out. We're going up. We're right next to the roof right now. We're at 62 feet, which I would have thought that the landmark building was a little bit taller. Ooh. But um, still, that means that if I can go up, usually I fly at around 100 feet. I should be safe. I think that the tallest point of this building is this clock tower up here. So as soon as I'm above here, it should be safe enough that um, I won't have anything around. I just want to take a look behind me, make sure that there's no big trees. It looks like we're okay. Back there you can see Manor Haven Bay and the marina. Um, if you look very closely, you might be able to see St. Stephen's. It's kind of behind this tree right here in the middle. Um, over here we have the fire department. And it looks like, for my sake, we are above all of the trees. So that's good. I think today is going to be a short flight because it's a little bit windy out today. And I'd rather be safe than um, sorry. But we'll see what we see. So first off, let's go up a little bit higher. And let's go back a little bit. And then we can take a nice look at the building. Oops, we're going to go down. So this is the landmark building. It was built in 1908 and it was completed in 1916. And I know that because earlier I walked around the building and um, I checked. So what do you say, let's go over to the front of the building now. Right here, this is the parking lot and this is Main Street. And it's the parking lot for the library across the street. There's the library right there. And in a second, I'm going to turn around and we'll get a view of the front, well, what we consider the front of Landmark. I have a feeling that all of the different agencies that use this building all um, they all consider whatever entrance they use as the front of the building. But for the Port Washington Children's Center, this is the front right here. And downstairs you can see the entrance to the PRC, which is the Parent Resource Center. So here's something I wanted to do. I wanted to go up a little bit higher and um, look straight down and see what we could see. I don't want to get too close because the building actually has wires in this courtyard that are supposed to scare away the birds. So um, I don't want to get caught in those. So we're going to fly right over the courtyard. You can see the clock tower over on the right. Now this, I think, is going to be pretty cool. Oops, we're going to go down. Um, right here in the middle, oops, um, you can see a skylight and that is actually a skylight to our gymnasium or our gym um, but i guess since the lights are off you can't see inside of it right now the uh, skylights that are over on the left hand side are skylights that are um, they're in a hallway on the top floor of the uh, where the seniors live so now oh, let's look this way and we're going to look up. Oops, I always make that mistake. We're going to look up. There you can see um, our playground and our field. Everything's still looking good. You can't see the preschool playground. Oh, you can see it a little bit. You can see the Children's Center playground um, because there's so many trees. Uh, but that's a good thing because they give us a lot of shade in the summertime. And if it's a hot summer, then we're going to need it. So. Um, let's take a little trip. 
<clears throat> sometimes at the Children's Center, we go to Stannard's Brook Park. So let's head there now. To go to Stannard's Brook, you would um, go down this road that's right beneath us. So I don't know how far I'm going to be able to get with this. Yeah, it's saying, it's saying that we have a little bit of aircraft interference, uh, which I don't really know. I don't think I'm high enough that I should be interfering with any airplanes, but just to play it safe, I'm going to uh, turn around. I don't really want to go too close to um, where it's dangerous. So I'm going to bring it back down. Something else I wanted to see was a close-up of the clock tower that we saw before. So we're going to head over there. So right now I'm at 147 feet, so I'm definitely above the clock tower, so I can get a little bit closer. We're at 130 feet. And uh, let's look down. See, I think that this is really cool right here. Uh, that we could see right into um, an area that not a lot of people get to see. There's a lot of trees around here, and uh, you can see there's a flagpole. There's a lot of stuff reaching up into the sky, uh, and as a drone pilot, you always have to be aware of that. So I'm flying very carefully today. Um, I want to be very careful that I don't crash into anything or get stuck in any trees. But I think that I did a pretty good job. So right now, I'm going to bring it back home and attempt to make a safe landing. Let's see if you could see me. I'm standing at the corner of the building. There I am. So what we're going to do is we're going to head over right above me. And it's going to be a little bit close because we're right in between these trees and the building. But I think that we can do it. I think that I can do it. Let's see. I'm going to have to bring it over a little bit more. I just really don't want to hit that tree. looking up right now I can see the drone is just above me and if I lower the camera to straight down view you could see that I'm correct so now we're gonna bring it down and we should be landing a few feet in front of me as we bring it down I'd like to thank everyone for watching the video I hope you all enjoyed getting a close-up bird's eye view of the landmark building and please let me know if there's any other areas around Port Washington that you would like me to explore with a drone. All right, goodbye. Landing.